What's a thing that all men do but never admit doing? Well that's something I'm not willing to admit. This thread in a nutshell. Touch my balls. Dot. Push my balls. Dot. Grab my balls. Dot. Feel existential dread. Dot. Scratch my balls. I am not going to fall for this. Feel crushing loneliness. Pee in a completely unexpected direction. Realizing that someone was flirting with you like five years late. Remember compliments years after they're given. Pick up signs but not act on them for to the fear of misinterpreting. And then act oblivious. One half of these comments are dick jokes and the other half is just depression. Edit. I posted this this morning and come home from work to find 15,000 upvotes and an award. This much happened in four hours. Tears of joy. Tactical wank. Wanting a hug real bad. Wanting affirmation from their partners that they are sexy and desired. Pee on shit stains in the toilet bowl. Efficiency. Lead lives of quiet desperation. Imagine a million outcomes when a random girl see us eye to eye. Shaving your pubes at 14 even though no one is gonna see it ever. I remember when I was like 6 I did that thing where I pushed my dick in. Using telepathy to link a small portion of our minds together so we can reduce the pain of getting our balls hit, by dividing small portions of the pain to any man within a few meters. Go over every little minute detail in their heads of the conversation they had with someone they are even a little bit attracted to. Put their hand in their pocket to adjust a boner or their balls when they're stuck to their leg. There are two kinds of man. A man who picks his nose, and a man who lies about picking his nose. I dk why but whenever I start falling asleep and someone calls me out on it, it's always my first instinct to deny it. I will be asleep on my couch and my girlfriend will be like, are you sleeping? 100 times and have to shake me awake and I'll be like, I've been awake the whole time. Edit. Glad I'm not the only one lmao. Grab their own butt to see what it feels like. Tell ourselves that having someone who loves us is a luxury. Shave our moustache down to a Hitler stash for five seconds just to see what it would look like out of morbid curiosity. Edit. Kinda sad my most upvoted comment is about Hitler. Take longer than normal showers just standing there under the hot water because no one will love you. Wonder if they should go to the doctor, then convince themselves they don't need to. Edit. I went in turns out I had testicular cancer. Don't put it off. Adjust cock and balls in public when no one's watching, at least when we think no one is. Finding a really cool rock on the ground, then taking it with us. Fantasize completely made up scenarios where we save the day, or win the girl over, etc. Touch my balls when I'm alone. Fantasize, daydream about being a hero or making a great sacrifice to save everyone. Talk to themselves. Getting annoyed when you put your dick back in your pants after a pee and suddenly feeling a wet drip on your leg. Taking steps back from the urinal to see how much strength we have while peeing. Always wash our dicks very thoroughly cause you just never know when you're gonna get your dick sucked. Even if the odds are low, they're never zero. While naked. Rotate your hips fast enough to make a fun slapping noise. Cry. Tuck the dick between their thighs to find out what they would look like as a woman. Put on a show for your dog. Sing a show tune and do a little soft shoe. Then give it a big ending and pause for applause while your dog looks at you and slow blinks. Realizing like 10 years later that that one girl you were hanging out with was 100% saying she was DTF and we are fucking idiots for not realizing. Bottom ups everything and then die of stress induced heart problems in their 40s like a real man. Wanting platonic touch, i.e. hugs. I've discovered that a lot of my childhood guy friends as teenagers used to watch PRN in the same room together. None of them will admit to it until you promise it doesn't make them gay. Unsticking balls from legs, pants. Peeing loud on purpose. Getting called by someone while you're jerking off and just saying whatever you can to get him to shut up. Admire an attractive girl. Most won't admit it when confronted about it though. Sit down for a piss. Sometimes we need to treat ourselves. If there's a scale in the bathroom, we're gonna weigh ourselves before and after a good poop.